All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are live. Welcome to Retro Request Stream. Starting with uh, Flying Dragon yes, tonight. I'm back, and oh, Hayden <laughs> hey, back Christensen. Guys. Yeah, I had my shit. This is bullshit. I had my shit absolutely cranked. I think I was watching a video or something. So uh, scared the shit out of me. Um, we're gonna play on beginner. Let's see what happens. In compliance with Master Juan's last request, Ryuhi begins his journey to Shorinji. So basically there's these like ancient scrolls um, and of the Hiryuken, he he Hiryu no Ken, and it makes you the most powerful warrior and um, they're almost all disappeared. Okay, right. I haven't played this game in like a long fuck since I was like fucking probably eight years old, so I didn't realize it was gonna just throw me into the fucking shuffle right away. Oh my god, why is it making me fight two bosses back to back? Okay, whatever. Now we got super kicks. Okay. So part of the game is journeying to the tournament. Okay, I can't attack when I'm in the air. Um and, and part of it is participating in tournaments. There we go. Okay, we're all healed up. This game is incredibly difficult. Um, so A, or sorry, B is punch, A is kick, and up is jump. That's right. This is like one of the first fighting games. Like, like 1v1 fighting games. And it's actually got some depth to it. Oh my god, dude. This guy's basically Toad Man if you can do him right. There we go. Okay, now we got the fucking... So what we've got to get is the fucking... Ah. Oh, how do I get in there, man? We've got to get the key. There's a key we need. So sometimes you have to, like, journey around until one of these bosses drops a key. And each... Oh, what do we got there? Oh, nice. This is like invincibility. Thankfully, a lot of the power-ups, if they're... There's a good power-up in one of those statues, but I don't know... Uh, I don't think it's worth it to try getting down there. There we go. Okay, so yeah, once you fought five bosses, that's how you get the key. Okay, so now we gotta go in here. How's it going tonight, Vector? Dude, I haven't played this fucking game. I didn't realize it just throwed me into the fucking fire right away. Throwed me to the wolves immediately. Okay, I think this is where we like learn how to fight in the tournament. Shorinji, it's going all right? Well done. I commend you. For coming. I'm Gengai. Defense is the key, since it is the first secret of Shorinji. While you are here, let's work on your defensive skills. Dude, I used to play the shit out of this game, but I, like I said, I haven't played it since I was like fucking eight years old. I'm gonna turn this brightness down on my light. Hopefully it doesn't make me look even shittier than I already look. Uh, instruction, instructions from Shingen. Defend the circle mark on your body. Attack the circle mark on your opponents. So basically the D-pad is your like defense. And then since I actually know ah, oh, since I actually know like some tricks and stuff I can do more than just, like just the basics in this first fight, so I should be able to. Should be able to just like destroy the fucking first boss here. All right. Defense? Sounds like some Yagi-Do bullshit. 
How's it going, Fire Lord? Listen carefully. The circle mark indicates where your enemy will attack. So the circles kind of show you, like, the openings and stuff. Um, but I don't remember all the tricks, but I do know a few. I do know one came back to me, like, immediately. So I'll see if I can pull it off. Basically, if you're blocking upwards, you can grab their arm and throw them down. And you pretty much always want to kick. Because they they can't throw you. Oh, I don't know why that didn't work. Um, they can't throw you if you're kicking. But if you're punching, they can grab your arm and throw you. Oh yeah, they can also do that. I don't know how to do that. You can also grab those. Those are like heels. I used to know how to do the, the helicopter kick. Oh, I want to try and do that fucking... That throw. Damn, she keeps kicking me into the head instead of uh, punching. There we go. I don't... There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you can do that. Oh, hi, Mark. Alright, first opponent down. This is- that's just training, though. The tournament is way harder. For your diligent training, you will be taught one of the secrets of the Shir of Shirinji. The trick throw. <laughs> I already knew it, bitch. Let your opponent uh, attack your upper body. Uh, it's called your head. Then suddenly throw your enemy down. I like how he doesn't tell you how to do it at all. Fuck! <laughs> Damn. You can get like a good sweep if you can if you can take their legs out. Oh, head kick, baby. Eat shit. Fuck, I used to know how to do that helicopter kick. Uh-oh, I'm getting fucked here. There we go. Always head kick. Because like I said, if they punch, if you punch, they can do the same thing. There you go. Eat shit, bitch. See, so you turn your defense into an offense with that, with that throw. Your reward for successful completion of training Shingan secrets blue circle indicates enemies weak points ah right triangle indicates point where enemy can be yeah 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 it's like a one hit knockout yeah 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 so usually that'll only show up like once per fight and if you can get it oh now I have to fight the old guy Come on, baby. I honestly don't really know what's triggering uh, that. I'm just kind of hitting a lot of things at once. But yeah, you'll notice that I, I only kick because um, otherwise they can throw me. Just like how they, sh they should ideally only be kicking as well. There we go. Oh, you bitch. And the quicker you are, the higher the chance for you to land the hit. If you're slow... Oh, I should have went for the throw. Oh, no. There we go. Got him. What? He's still alive? Not anymore. The Dim Mac, yeah. The the touch of death. <laughs> we have received a letter of challenge from the Tusk Soldiers Army. This is the army that stole the secret scrolls and eliminated Juan. 
defeat the enemy and recover the secret scrolls. Of course. Of course. Every martial arts, uh, either old cheesy movie or game, had this exact plot. So this is the tournament, I think. I think we have to go to the tournament, though. Having become the Kung Fu Master of Shirinji, Ryuhi, oh, that's me, uh, sets out to become the best one-on-one -on -one competitor in the world. This will not be easy. Several top-notch opponents must be defeated. Do-do-do. <laughs> Trained against a bear. Oh, it's Khabib. He's basically Khabib in Magomedo. Litron. Unique qualities. Made out of fire, I'm pretty sure. He's so lit. Min Min. That's who I think I beat up when I was training. Her skills in Kung Fu are unmatched. She's like a faster version. Demon Kabuki, aka the Hulkster. Nickname, Laughing Devil. <laughs> this game's so cheesy, man. I love it. Okay, so the journey. So let's save. In case I get spanked, because there's like, I gotta fight five bosses here. I like his little, uh, I can't remember what that does. Um, I like his little, like, key eye when he attacks. And the only way to land between these is to jump up and land. You can just, like, skip over the boss, too. But you don't really want to do that with this boss. Because this is the easiest one. I don't know why they made the boss, uh, one of the bosses, like, a fucking six-year-old girl, but I guess so even, even even people like me can stand a chance. Son of a bitch. I don't know if you can kill those flying heads. Life, there we go. Okay, I think there is something in this one. Nope. Here we go. Insta-kill. Down. See, that's how you can, like, you don't get the upgrade, though. Like, if you, if you kill the boss, or just avoid the boss, um, instead of fighting them, you don't get the upgrade. Hey, Finny, how's it going? Save's coming already. This game gets really hard after, after this, uh, segment. So, probably once I get to the tournament, I will definitely be save's coming even more. There is a password system, so it's not like it's not like you're cheating. You're just saving yourself 20 minutes writing down the password. Okay, you fucker. There we go. Okay, sorry, I have to get that apparently. Sorry about that. Okay. Let's roll! Shit. There's also two versions of this punch wave. I think the second one goes through enemies. Okay, this guy, I always, I always called him like Donkey Kong. This is the guy that I would usually try to skip. Oh no. Okay, here we go. Okay, we just need one more boss. So sometimes you can just cheese it a little bit. There we go. Come over here. Come over here, because the door is here. Damn it, we're going to have to do another lap. Okay, we can get that health, though. So what I usually try to do is cheese it um, so that I stay by the door when the boss spawns, so I can just grab the key. 
And, uh... Oh god. The health is no longer spawning. Unless this is where the health was. Ah, here it is, here it is. For those of you wondering... For those of you that just got here and you're wondering why the fuck... I'm having a hell of a time jumping... It's because the controls are, are uh, di different. <laughs> I'm, I'm legit hitting up to jump, so platforming is not this game's uh, strong suit. Alright, world tournament time. Time to get fucked. Elimination round. I remember this guy being easy. But once I get to the Tuscan Raider guy, it's fucking hard. This guy kicks all the time, so you can't use your you can't use your throws against them. I remember cheesing this guy, but I don't remember how. Nice. I like how these guys just eat head kicks like they're nothing. Come on! Get him! Ah, oh, you fuck! I can't remember how to do the, the helicopter kick. Because you can just fucking destroy dudes with that helicopter kick. going for the throw. Come on, baby. Come on, there we go. Got the throw. Killed him. Fuck yeah, brother. Do do do. Do 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 do. Alright, now we get to fight uh, Chun Li's older sister. Basically, that chick we fought earlier, but she's just like a fuck of a lot faster. Um, you guys can start putting your requests in now because. The odds of me beating the uh, Tuscan Raider are very low. I don't think I've ever beaten him. Fuck, I wish I knew how to... Oh, right! Okay, I learned something. I learned something, but it's not... <laughs> I figured it out, boys. Got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured out how to do it. Oh, it's slow as fuck, but if you hit him, man. Oops. I'm not sure if my health carries through. I don't think it does. Like, I think I, think I start with full health each time. That'd be fucking awful if I didn't. I'll just take a look. I'm at... I'm two zeros away from the end. I was too far away. Imagine, like, if this was, like, a real fight. They're just, like, jumping over each other. 
It's like, how do you avoid a low kick? Oh, you just jump over your opponent. Easy peasy. Just jump over the body like it's nothing. <laughs> okay, so before I save Scum... Okay, this guy, this is the boxer. The Tusken Raider is the guy that makes it to the finals. Or he's in like the real tournament. This is just like the, the heat or something. I don't really know. Listen carefully. Tusk soldiers are masquerading as your enemies. Ah, right. This boxer, yeah, transforms into a Tusken Raider guy. Now take back the secret scrolls. Then make your hero no ken. Perfect. Okay. All of a sudden, my master is here. But yeah, if you want to drop in your requests. Okay, so you definitely start with uh, full health. So that's good. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Maybe he's like a Muay Thai guy. It looks like he's trying to throw like a flying knee. Oh, nice. Crowd's just losing it. Fuck. Oh, it fucked me. Oh, I could have thrown him. There's a, this game has actually like spawned an entire series. Uh, there's a Nintendo 64 game too. I don't know if it's exactly like this or not, but it's called like Flying Heroes or something, or, or Flying Warriors. It might even be called Flying Dragon 64. I don't know. And then there's a, a sequel to this on the NES called Flying Warriors. I do have it on here, but I've never actually played it. Oh, you bitch! Just take my flying helicopter kick to the head. Don't be a sissy. Okay, here we go. This guy's so fucking hard, man. Because he fucking shoots you. Oh, suck on these nuts! All oh, right, okay, you gotta get the fuck out of there. He knows, he knows the same attacks I know. Oh, what am I doing, man? Uh oh. Nice, nice. Fucking throw him! No, jump! Nice, oh. Fuck! Throw him! Dude, I bet it- I bet my- my, uh, losing has nothing to do with the jank-ass controls. Oh, I docked- Ah, oh, K.O. Ha. Uh, but of- but of kills. Uh. Nice! No! No! Oh, oh, you fucking guy, man. Do you like how- Do you see how much the difficulty just spikes? You're just fighting, like, all these easy scrubs, and then fucking- The fucking Tusken Raiders just go all fucking nutso on you? I wonder if I could just spam this. Oh. Got him, got him. Got him. I have an idea. Oh! Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do from now on. When he goes to do his fucking bullshit shoot attack. Oh! I'm gonna fucking helicopter kick him. Oh, I'm not even facing the right way, dude. This game is effing intense! Oh! I just beat him! 
Dude, that's the first time I think I've ever beat that fucking guy in my life. Suck on these nuts, man. Suck on these nuts. I honestly don't even know what comes after this. Jungle Targan is one of the Tusk Soldiers army. They are an evil core from a very evil world. You don't say. The journey. Okay, so I don't know if we're going to this evil world now. Um, save state. Okay. Don't run away, kid. Ah, oh, you bitch. I don't know what that means when it's like this old man's face. Oh my god, dude. Damn, I thought there was gonna be something in there. Oh good, the kill. Dude, there's no way I'm getting to the next fucking fight. Ugh. Okay, leveled up my punches. Fuck, dude. This is so hard. Okay, here we go. This is who we want to fight first. And then we should have our punch upgrade for the next boss. There we go. There we go. Even stronger yet. I have no idea what that is other than points. Other than lol points. I like how my punches reach like further than my kicks. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, I thought I was going into the pit for sure. I don't know how to jump like down. Uh oh. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I'm. Uh, I don't think I'm beating this one, guys. So. Fuck me, dude. Alright, I'll try one more time. Um, classic NES. Hey, Sass, how's it going, dude? <laughs> I've, this is the furthest I've ever gotten in this game. I beat, I beat the boss that I've never beaten before, so. Um, but, but we're ready for the next game, so if anyone wants to put in a request. About to cook dinner? Wow, I just ate shit there. Fish and chips. Man, I haven't had fish and chips in a long time. Game over. Never give up. I will teach you the password for revival. Use now. Use later. Use now, I guess. There's infinite continues, but uh, let me tell you. Yeah, I haven't had fish and chips in forever, dude. I used to make it quite a bit. <laughs> this game controls like shit. By the way, absolute fucking shit. Just go down there. There we go. Come on. Oh god. Points. People, everybody lives for the points on the NES. Uh, yeah, I don't think I can kill those flying heads. Oh yeah, here we go. Dude, we haven't had a boss yet, though. That's not good. We did a full lap without a boss. Alright, first boss down. Uh, you had Domino's Pizza? 
Nice, dude. Vector, what game do you want next? I'm ready, I'm ready for the next game here. I don't think I'm getting past this stage. It's fucking impossible. This is, I've got past the boss that I've never been able to beat. Yeah, you can't kill those guys. Got past the boss I've never been able to beat, and now the next stage is TMNT4? Okay. Alright, leveled up my kicks. Look at this shit. You ever, see <laughs> you ever see a kick so fine in your life? Okay, do I carry over my, uh, no, you start from scratch. Alright, TMNT4 it is.